Have you had anything to drink tonight? Oh no, I'm just gay. <laughs> what? Okay, I mean... <laughs> Alright. Yeah, uh... I've heard what they do in the showers. I might like it. Cool. I love being a sidekick. It's so cool. And I know what you really think of me. Alright, they sh <laughs> All right, well, they, uh, they'll they be they'll be here shortly, apparently, is what they're telling me. Oh. Who's this? Hey, uh, this is Justin. He's here to fix our... Um... Who's oh, Justin? Hi. Stereo system? I know when you're lying. Who's Justin? I got him. I got him, officer. Alright. Don't do it. Please don't. Ugh, why? I'm straight up getting priority stopped. What's up guys, GT Gamer here and welcome back to OCRP and today we're playing with John and Jordan, it's going to be awesome, we're gay lovers and Jonathan, my boyfriend, is having an affair on me. Uh, sorry, I'm going to apologise in advance for the terrible accent and also about to follow is a traffic stop with me in a Porsche as a different character and you will understand why that's relevant in a bit but it might seem out of place, it is relevant, believe me. I'm uh, film filming this intro uh, after we've filmed everything, just to try and explain why it won't make sense as much at first, but trust me, it's awesome. And in this video, featuring alongside Jonathan and Jordan, is Jeff. So without further ado, let's get into it. I <laughs> think I'm getting fucked with. Oh, yep, he wants to talk to me. Fuck. I did some jank shit at that red light back there, guys. <laughs> uh, let's see what he wants. Roll down my window. Uh, windows down. Perfect. I think I've got the right plate. Yep. Wow. Ooh. Uh, major frame lags. That's bad. A55 hole is my plate. Let's see what he thinks of that. Good evening, Officer Fabiano with the LSPD. Reason for the stop is uh, your little trick you did back there, turning <laughs> it's Jeff onto uh, the, the the elves in there, and then you uh, took out a sign. Where, where are you headed? Uh, I'm just driving around, man. Nice new car, upgraded it. Um, sorry about the red light. I wasn't really paying that much attention, to be honest. Probably shouldn't uh, well, admit to if that. If you're gonna you know. drive. If you're gonna drive a vehicle here in the state of San Andreas, you you need to uh, care about things like that. You have your driver's license on you and proof of insurance. Yeah, sure. Give me one sec to grab it. Here you go, man. My name is uh, Rich Bastard. Rich Bastard. So is that your actual uh, birth name? Well, Richard, but you know, my friends call me Rich. Okay. And how do you spell your last name? Uh, that's going to be B A S T A R D. All right, Mr. Bastard. All right, just uh, do me a favor and just hang out in the car. I'm going to run, make sure everything uh, checks out okay with the vehicle, okay? Okay, no worries, man. And as I said, I apologize. I just wasn't paying that much attention. All right, yeah, you need to be doing that. <laughs> that's cool. We got pulled over by Jeff. I think that's the first time in one of my videos I got pulled over by Jeff. Yeah, I did some jank shit at that light, though. I'm not going to lie. Holy fuck. Here he comes. Oh, I think he's reading my plate. A55 hole. <laughs> uh, let's see what he thinks of that. Jeff can usually take a joke, so hopefully he won't uh, get too wound up about that. It is a custom plate, obviously. A55 hole. That's great. But yeah, what happened? I literally just pressed record because I saw the cop car. I went through a red light, which I don't think he saw, and then I was in the straight lane, and I shot right across another lane, and drifted and took out a sign. <laughs> so that's good. Uh, that was not fun. Ah well. I wonder if he likes my car. It's a great car, it really is. Interesting glitch, you can't go first person when your engine's turned off. Don't know why. I guess, well, I don't know. It's the same when you're dead, you can't look right, and it's really, really irritating. But, never mind. Nothing I can really do about that. Knowing Jeff, he'll probably just give me a ticket uh, for the plate, let alone anything else. I, I reckon I'm getting a ticket, because that was... That was definitely careless driving. My car's so dirty. 
It makes no sense. I've been driving on concrete roads. It makes literally no sense. Oh, here he is. Let's see what he wants to say. All right, Mr. Bastard, you're going to be getting two citations tonight. It's going to be a uh -huh. total of $4,000 total. One's for careless driving. One is uh, failure to yield to a traffic device. I need your signature here at the bottom. Come on, man. Don't you think that's a bit excessive? I don't, because you don't you don't seem to care. Like you said, you, you didn't care. You weren't paying attention. No, uh, I, do, that, I do that, care. Uh, I was just carried you away a little bit. And then you came across... You know, I could have gotten you for the third offense for the uh, destroying the sign back there. I'm not going to do that. What if I pay for the sign? From there. Do you pay for the sign? Yeah, if I, I pay for I the told sign, you I'm damage. not citing you for that. I'm, I'm citing you for the other two. Yeah, but if I pay for the sign, surely that's a gesture of goodwill. I reckon that's worth knocking a ticket off. Nah, I don't think it works that way. I just think you since you're at the bottom, it'll be two. Okay, man. 316, 19, 25, careless driving. 316, 074, failure to yield to a traffic device. Here you go. I misspelled reluctantly so bad. Reluctantly. Alright, appreciate that. Here's your copy right here. Yep, no worries, man. I just uh, paid it through online banking. All right, fantastic. All right, like I get said, here's your uh, copy of the citations, uh, and the court date's right there. So, do me a favor and uh, keep it slowed down camera. and be careful and pay attention to what you're doing. Okay. All right, no worries, man. Appreciate the uh, break with the sign. Absolutely, sir. All right, Mr. Bastard, uh, you're safe to go. Once you get back to my car, okay? Yep. Have a nice day, man. All right, take care. And drive off like madman. <laughs> yeah, I'll basically show you guys what I did because I don't think I got it on camera. I was here, and Jeff was over there where that vehicle is. Make sure he's not behind me, capturing me, do the same thing. And I shot across like this, drifted, and took out a sign by there. So yeah, that was good. Right, anyway, let's uh, let's find something else to do. So you just deny everything? Be like, nah, I didn't have, I didn't have sex. <laughs> And be like, why are you here? Just, I don't know, just like, make up something. Do I need to have a weapon, or is it just gonna be a fist fight, or what? No, 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 we're not gonna fight, we're just gonna like, like, a verbal fight, man. Okay. Oh, I need to go to my apartment, I've got 20 grand of dirty money in my pocket. Put it in your car. Hmm, no I can just go to my apartment. Okay. Probably shouldn't be blown through red lights, but you know. Right, I'm just going to warn you that my role play is going to be a bit OTT. I'm going to be one of them. <laughs> oh, okay. Okay, for sure, for sure. For sure. Um, do you mind just stopping by Michael's house first just to check on my audio? Since I did just... That's fine. I'm literally around the corner. Okay. My apartment's the massive tower block behind. Oh, yeah. I think I just... Fuck. I fucked myself. <laughs> yeah. Alrighty. Yeah. Fuck. I can't even see the rock fucking light. Ah, oh, this is bad. I think it's Jeff again. Why can't I use the hammer? I don't know. I'm going to do the gay voice. Fuck it. Yeah. <laughs> uh, Good evening, Officer Fabiano with the LSPD. You're using for the stop is your speed. Had oh, you, hey, uh, cutie. 89 on my rear radar there. Oh, how you doing? Oh, I'm so sorry. Well, you were doing 89 on Eclipse. That's a new one for me. You have your driver's license to prove insurance of the vehicle? Yeah, sure. My name's Fred Daphne. Fred Daphne? Yeah. Okay, Fred, why, why, why are you pulling off here into the grass? Oh, because he was pulling me over, officer. I didn't want to get hit. Okay, well, I mean, I, I get that. Have you had anything to drink tonight? Oh, no, I'm just gay. What? Okay, I mean, <laughs> all right. You have your, uh, what was that name on the driver's license again? Fred Daphne. Fred Daphne? Yeah, D-A-P-H-Y-N. My voice died then. Okay, Mr. Daphne, just sit tight for me, okay? I'll be right okay. back. Okay. <laughs> what was that? 
I'm getting pulled over by Jeff, and he said, Sir, have you had anything to drink tonight? That I'm was like, hilarious. No, I'm just oh, no, gay. I'm just gay. Oh, uh, where are you? Right here? Oh my god, you're out here, so I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go say something. Oh, please. What's your name again? Freddy? Fred Daphne. <laughs> this is so bad. Oh, hey Nathan. Yoo-hoo! <laughs> oh, come on, please walk over and say something. This is the weirdest roleplay I've ever done. I I don't even understand my reaction. I'm trying not to offend people, but my god. <laughs> uh, the, the whole reason I was speeding is because I need to get to my flat to put the dirty money I have in my pocket away. You can see I've got like seven and a half grand of dirty money, so if you arrest me or something, I am fucked. <laughs> I'm just gonna be like straight up. I'm in a bank robbery. That's all I'm gonna have to say. I've been selling drugs. Alright, so Daphne, do me a favor and uh, step out of the vehicle for me. Why? Um, I'm asking you to step out of the vehicle. I want to have a chat with you. Okay. Alright, you can go ahead and uh, face towards the vehicle. You have anything illegal on you that's going to poke me, stick me, hurt me in any way? Oh, not at all. I hope I don't. Right. No, I'm good. Fuck, he's going to find my dirty money. What is that? <laughs> Just fucking air humping behind me. Oh, uh, what's that you're for? Gonna be, uh, you're gonna be uh, detained at this time. The reason for this is because you're driving on an expired license and you have a bunch of money on you. We're gonna find out what's going on with that, okay? Oh dear. I didn't know about my license officer, I promise. What if I go to the DMV now and fix it? Oh, that's trippy. Uh, just hold on. We're gonna find out. I'm sure we can figure something out. I'm floating. I'm levitating. You right, saw it I'm here first. Some items off you, okay? Okay. What's he gonna take? I may be getting arrested for having dirty money on an expired license. Oh my god, I wanna come over there and talk to you, but I fucking my thing's not working. Oh that sucks. Oh, this is why. Okay. Bleh. Maybe no, I don't know. Ah, oh, he took my money. God damn it. What else is he gonna take? Confiscated from you zero dollars? Six tequila. Oh shit. Right, have you had, had any tequila tonight? Oh no. I bought that the other day, I just forgot to, it was in my car. Alright, wh why, what are you doing rolling around with seven thousand dollars in your pocket? Oh, my friend gave it to me. He's a good egg. Your friend gave it to you? Okay, why would why would he give you $7,000? Oh, because he's so cool like that. Okay. You have anything illegal in the car I need to know about? Oh, no. Not a co of course not, officer. Not of course not. Okay. Whatever. I'm placing the in my vehicle, okay? Okay. I'm sure we can figure something out. I think Jeff is live streaming. I can't wait to see the comments on his video, <laughs> on his live streams. Oh my god. This is officially the worst accent I've ever come up with. I love this Impala though. Driver's side. Oh, that's not what I wanted to do. That's not what I wanted to do. Uh, nothing of interest. I can't even spell today. That's terrible. Interest. Interest. Ah, <laughs> uh, this may be a problem. Oh, is that a secondary? <laughs> nope, seems fine, but excited. Do I smell alcohol on your breath? <laughs> oh, we got a trooper here. How you doing, Trooper? Jeff is thorough. Hey, pretty good. Uh, I stopped this guy doing 80, you wouldn't believe it, 89 on Eclipse. <laughs> wow. Yeah, that is pretty bad. 89 on Eclipse. At least he didn't see the red and, light. Uh, so I, I get him stopped talking with him, 
He tells me that uh, he's not drunk. He's just gay, uh, whatever that means. So I was like, okay, well, uh, he, he's not showing signs of impairment or anything like that. He had seven thousand uh, dollars of dirty money on him, or a, a large sum of it. Uh, he had some tequila fuck. on him. I removed that from him, uh, and that was about it. I didn't see anything else there, but his license is expired. That's just bad. Okay. I may be going down. So I'm just gonna probably start uh, working on the arrest report and all that. Fuck. You don't mind uh, starting to tow this way? We're gonna get this thing on out of here. Damn uh, the man. Clear. Marijuana residue in the vehicle, some uh, some chip bags and whatnot in there, but that's all I saw. Damn. Okay. Yeah, I can get that tow started. That was bad. All right, appreciate that. I'm gonna start yep. working on the arrest report here. I'm Oop. gonna let him know what he's gonna be Probably going Probably should in change for. my camera angle um, a little bit more. Uh, the reason why I was asking you down here was, uh, you guys uh, doing anything with the the dirty money that we're we're, we're confiscating from tonight? Uh, yeah. Uh, I can turn it in for you if you want, and I can update the okay. uh, tracking. All right, I appreciate that. Figured I'd probably send yeah. to you guys. Yeah, no problem. So you're saying that if I tell you where I got that money from, I won't get in trouble for what I say, and you'll drop the suspended license charge? Yep. That is correct. Okay, I can work with that. Okay, I mean, like, I, I'd wait till we get down to the station. Once we get down to the station, we're going to get your fingerprints, we're going to give you your Miranda rights, and then we'll start talking down there and we'll figure it all out, okay? That's fine. I won't be in jail long, will I? Overall, this, no, it's not looking like it's going to be very long. Probably just an in and out deal. Oh, that's cool. I've heard what they do in the showers. I might like it. <laughs> what? Oh, <laughs> uh, I give up. I give up. <laughs> Whose idea was it to do this character? I blame you, Jonathan. The whole point in this video was to do a domestic dispute and I was going to go to my apartment to put my dirty money away and then Jonathan asked me, can, hey man, can you come over and check my audio's all okay? I was like, yeah, sure, why not? And I almost killed Jeff and <coughs> voice break, sorry, I've been talking all week and um, yeah, he pulled me over searched me because I had an expired license which I set to expired for no apparent reason <laughs> Ben trying to delete a vehicle and yeah now I'm going to jail which is pretty bad okay he's actually dragging me alright we're gonna get you fingerprinted let's go ahead and let you know right now you have the right to remain silent Oh. Any say anything you say can and will be used uh, against you in the court of law you have a right to an attorney Cannot afford one will be appointed to you by a state um, Andreas. You understand these rights? Yeah. Um. Okay, something's not loaded properly. Jeremiah, uh, I only see you. Uh, yeah. Yeah. I'm. Don't know where I am. Okay, so you understand your rights, correct? Yeah. All right, fantastic. All right, just sit tight with us. Okay. We're gonna go. We're gonna figure this out. What we're gonna do here. Uh, okay. So, anywho, uh, I, I'm thinking here, and I think of the thing I can work with you on is gonna be the citation of the 89 on uh, on Eclipse. I don't want to have to give that up. Trust me, because I think it's ridiculous. You're doing 89 <laughs> miles an hour. Um, I agree. But I want to let you know uh, that uh, if you want to tell us where you got the uh, the money from. We can work a deal with you on that. Okay. So this guy came up to me, yeah, and he was like really sketchy, and he had black hair and a hoodie, and he mm -hmm. said that if I go and take this powder to some guys in a dark alley, then he'll give me seven percent of the split. And they they give me an envelope that was full of money, and he gave me some, and then he just walked off, and that's how I got the money. <laughs> okay, where did this uh, happen at? Um. It was near the, it was near the LS River. Okay, LS River like in uh, Davis and Rancho up up north further towards uh Mirror Park. It was like underneath the highway by the LS Customs. Okay, so that's gonna be over there in the La Mesa area? Yeah, he, he just, I was walking down the street and he just stopped in his car. And he was, he told me what to do, so I went down there and there was like four guys 
and they give me an envelope full of money and I walked off and he took the envelope, gave me some and then he just drove off. It was easy cash, okay, so I thought why not. Was he, what kind of vehicle was he driving in? It was a uh, Porsche. Like a really nice one. That's the character I was playing earlier. <laughs> you remember what color it was? Uh, I think it was green. Was he an older gentleman? No, he was quite young. Sort of like 25. And he n he didn't have a first name or anything that you can remember? No, he was really dodgy. <laughs> I'm making this up. Did he see that he was dodgy, but did, what, did he seem like he came off kind of like uh, like rude towards you or anything like that? Oh no, he was friendly. He also said he was single. <laughs> okay. Did the vehicle have any uh, like uh, underglow on it or any kind of weird things that would make it stand out in the crowd? Yeah, it looked like a race car, and it had like green glowing under the car. I'm describing my own car. <laughs> Okay. And did the vehicle have a uh, spoiler on it or anything like that, you remember? Yeah, it was a really big spoiler. I think it was, like, green and black. Okay. Fantastic. No, I really do appreciate your cooperation. Like I said, an 89 on Eclipse is, is a pretty big deal. Um, it's probably going to take you to jail on that alone. Um, but in this this case, we're, at, we're actually, since you're giving us a, a lot of information here and, you, and you're being honest with us, we're, we're going to work with you on that, okay? Because that's your biggest thing. The expired is not going to be a big deal. You're going to be an in and out, uh, in and out tonight, okay? Oh, thank God. My boyfriend's probably like, where am I? He didn't I? have a first name. He didn't, like, when you talk to some stranger like that, he didn't, like, greet himself or anything like that? No, he just told me what to do. It was a okay, gray so hoodie. Again, tell me what, all right, tell me exactly what he told you to do. He just pulled up in his car. And he said, hey man, do you want to do a job? And I was like, what for? And he held up a bag and he was like, hey, if you take that down there, I'll give you some money. And I said, how much? And he said, about 10 grand. So I took the bag down and they took it. They was like really weird. And then I walked back up and he just, he took the envelope out of my hand and he gave me some money and just drove off into the distance. My voice. So he just then. wanted you to drop off a bag of money down in an alleyway and then just walk away. There wasn't. You didn't meet anybody down there or anything like that. No, there was. There was four people down there, but the guy in the car didn't seem like he trusted them. Okay, and how did they act uh, towards you once you got down there? They kept calling me names. They were calling you names. Yeah, because of how I look. Okay, what were they like? Just derogatory slurs and whatnot. Yeah, pretty much. Do you remember what any of the, you remember what any of them looked like? No, it was really dark. It was under a tunnel. Okay, so they were cloaked under the under the night. Yeah. I mean, not. Do you know if they were like white male, black male, any females, anything like that? I think they were all white men. One of them was really fat and had a beard. <laughs> oh, I hate myself. I love the way they print this out over the radio, even though it didn't happen. I literally am just making this up to get out of this ticket. <laughs> right, we do appreciate your cooperation during this. Oh, that's fine. Uh, I'm a man of my word. I I'm not going to get you for the 89, okay? Because that's, that's going to cost you a lot of money on that one. It's all right, cutie pie. I trust you. What, what were you thinking? What were you thinking? <laughs> what were you doing at 89 on, a on Eclipse? It's just a fast car, and I just I wanted to put my foot down. Where were you leaving? Oh, I was at work. You're, where do you work at? Union. Uh, Vanilla Unicorn. Almost Okay, so up, you were on Vanilla... You were down in uh, the Davis area, and then you went north on Elgin, and then just took Eclipse over? Yeah, pretty much. I'm a dancer. Okay, so once you left the Vanilla Unicorn... And you were so on your way towards Eclipse before I caught up with you. Right before then, is that whenever you met up with this uh, gentleman and those four people? Oh no, this happened on my way to work. I went to get a uh, gas up in Mirror Park at the 24/7, and I was going down Popular okay. Street. Dude, this is the most annoying voice I've right, ever. I'm so have, uh, sorry, guys. You got your, uh, your this is not even what well. this video is meant to be. Yep, took all the notes. All right, fantastic. I had the the black hair and hoodie gentleman. 
<laughs> Still uh, in the Los, Los Santos River area near the customs right there in La Mesa off Poplar Street. Uh, that comet that he is uh, talking about, uh, I actually stopped it earlier this evening. It was a uh, <laughs> Richard Bastard, actually, with the That's name on me. there. <laughs> you want to add that to your notes? <laughs> yep, will do. I wasn't going to put that in a video, but it's, I'm going to have to now. It was relevant. That's funny. That's really right, funny. So, yeah, the vehicle had underglow and a big spoiler. That's that's the exact one I stopped earlier tonight for uh, for careless driving <laughs> and for uh, running a red light. On top oh, of that, my God. His job was to take a bag down the alley to four different gentlemen. He said that there were four white males, and the uh, one that stood out to him was the one that was uh, a larger gentleman with <laughs> a beard. <laughs> they don't even exist. Okay. I'm sure he knows That's that. That's everything I have there. Twiddles right. thumbs and looks cute AF. With a smiley face. <laughs> Little winky face. Jeff must hate me so much right now. I'm so sorry, Jeff. <laughs> oh, this has been funny, though. Oh, this is going to be a long video as well. Yeah, he was like, I saw the car. He, I said in his chat that it was a BS story, and he's like, "Well, he he's not. He, I don't think he was lying to me because I just I just pulled over the car that he was talking about. What car did you tell him?" <laughs> uh, you know, uh, you wasn't here earlier. Yeah, he was. When I got pulled over in the Porsche for going through a red yeah. light. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, that character is now wanted for selling drugs. <laughs> <laughs> I told him oh. that I was walking down Popular Street. And this guy approached me in that car, gave me a bag and said, hey man, do you want to earn some money? I went, yeah, take this bag down to those guys in the alleyway, and when you come back with the money, I'll give you some. <laughs> That's my excuse for having dirty money, and I got out of a fucking, I got out of an 89 mile an hour arrest charge in a 30 zone. <laughs> nice. Mate, that was the funniest roleplay ever. I hate so myself for my accent, though. Do you know what's funny? I'm sat in the jail cell and they're looking at me. I just put in the chat, twiddles firms and looks cute AF with a winky face. <laughs> <I'll be back>. <laughs> <laughs> Jeff must hate me so much right now. There you go. <laughs> Alright. And like I said, you're just gonna be in and out here, so they're gonna be probably released. You have a, you have somebody who can come pick you up? Oh yeah, I can get home, it's fine, thank you. Okay, the only thing you're going to have to do is they're going to have to bail you out at $3,000, okay? Okay, I can do that. Um, can either you or John come and bail me out three grand? Okay, and once you pay that, then they're going to... John, come bail him out for three grand. <laughs> oh, actually, I think I can pay it. All right. It should be a, he should be in and out here pretty shortly. I think it's, somebody's already on his way to come pay, bail him out. Okay. Yeah, he just paid it online. I appreciate the help. Hey, no problem. I... Do what? Uh, I got a psychic ability. He just told me that he paid online for the bail. Oh uh, no, no, yeah, no. I understand that. Yeah, no, we uh, we just got confirmation that the payment went through. I was just about to let you know. Cool. I love being a psychic. It's so cool. And I know what you really think of me. All right. They sh <laughs> All right. Well, they uh, they'll be they'll be here shortly. Apparently, is what they're telling me. Oh, I cannot wait to get in. Talk to my boyfriend. God, it's been such a long day. Ooh, there's my other car. How the hell did that get there? Seriously. Oh, baby. Baby. Oh, uh, hey. Hey, uh, hey, honey. H oh, sweetheart. You won't believe what happened. I totally got arrested. Um. Oh, y y why, why'd you get arrested, honey? Oh, I had some money on me, and it was, like, really bad, and I, I got caught speeding. <laughs> oh, oh, my God. Oh. What, you look fabulous. Oh, oh, I was in a rush to come home really and see you, too. baby. Oh, okay. Hey, um, do you have your license on you? I needed to do some paperwork. I need to just fill out the form on the counter here. So I just need your license to get your number. No, it's expired. Sorry, baby. They took it. Oh, oh they took it? Oh, Who's man. this? Hey, uh, this is Justin. He's here to fix our, um... Who's our Justin? stereo system. I know when you're lying. Who's Justin? No, he's just here to fix the stereo system, I swear. No, uh, get out of my house. You? No, 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 he can stay. He can stay. No, don't. Who, who don't, is it? Don't talk to Justin. Why are you, why are no, you pushing me out? No, who's no, Justin? Justin's fine. He's, no, Justin's my friend, okay? 
It's a, don't be don't get so defensive. What do you mean, Ever friend? You I got, got me. The new job at DUMB. No, he's just my friend. No, no you're, you're lying. lying. I know when yeah. you're lying. No, no, no. He's just my friend. I promise. He's just my friend. Listen, I wouldn't lie to you. Now would I? Yes, you're lying. I can see it. No, 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 no. I pro I promise. Hey, hey, Justin, did you did you like put away all this like stuff in there? Yeah, what do you mean yeah. stuff? Okay, okay, good. No, nothing, nothing, nothing. What stuff? No, you're gonna need to leave. Justin, you're gonna need to leave as well. Get out of my house. No, no, no. Justin's not gonna... No, this is my house Get too, Get out okay? of my house. No, hold on. I'm calling, I'm calling the police. Okay, I'm calling the police. I'm calling the police right you now, bastard. okay? They're gonna show up here. Oh you cheated God, on me. Show up. What is going on? No. Get your hands off Justin. Stop it. Here, Justin. Ew, no, ew. no, 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 no. Oh, stop it. Go. No. Stop touching Justin. You go in the other Fuck room. Fuck you, I hate you. Go. Go upstairs now. You bastard. Justin, I'm sorry about this. So I don't know what you and Jordan told the police. Exactly. But they know my description. You wouldn't know. You, wouldn't know you weren't there. That's a good point. You're not going to know any information. You weren't there. God damn it. Uh, so sketchy with this many cops around driving like this. Is that you on the bike? Really? Fuck you, Honey. Bitch. Hope you die, motherfucker. Bitch, get out of here. Go. Can you please stop mating with my car? Nah, oh. man, get the hell out of you, bitch. You did it now. <laughs> hey, no, pull the bike over on the sidewalk, sir. Your bike over. Yeah, man. What are you doing? Hey. Get off the bike, man. <laughs> Dude, what the fuck is even going on? I got him. I got him, officer. All right. All right. Uh, thanks. Thanks so much. All right, you, you, take just take your seat on the ground. Are you hurt? Uh, what the? Are fuck? you hurt, sir? No, 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 sir. No. <laughs> I can't believe that happened. Wow. Oh. I think I'm in trouble now. Fuck. This is bad. Well, this is weird. <laughs> I don't even know what to say to this. We were literally just screwing around to get back into the scenario. Okay, that's definitely more cops coming in. That's gotta be a hundred percent. Where are they though? I can't tell which direction it is. There it is. Oh no, you went past. Oh, here he is. He found his way. I'm impressed. This Ben will be a priority stop. I swear. Don't do it. Please don't. Ugh, why? I'm straight up getting priority stopped. Drive to the vehicle. I need to see them hands up in the air. I need you to stick them out the window, please. <laughs> wow. Alright. You have me covered? I'm gonna try and go around the door here. Alright, mm. after you. Open the door from the outside, please, and step out of the vehicle. Face the front of the vehicle. All right. Now, can I get you to take three steps back? Do not turn to face me. Thank you. Step up. That's good. Oh my God, sir, what did I do? What did I do? All right, sir. I'll. Uh, we'll get to that. Trust me. All right. What <laughs> I'm gonna do is I'm gonna ask to you to come back. It's the right. I should walk back with me. 
All right, sir, I want you to stand right here behind this charger. Do not move or I will take you. What is even happening? Right. I'm getting fucking priority stopped. Wow. All right. No problem. Good. I'll take the left. All right. I don't even know what's happening, guys. I don't know why I'm getting priority stopped. It's clear. It's clear. Get out of the way. I don't even put the guns down there, guys. Oh, that's weird. Alright, sir. Uh, uh, take you up to the side of the road here. Let's get you um, on the sidewalk fully so we don't get that car, please. Alright, I'm gonna search you. Do you have any of the poke me, stick me, or hurt me? No. No, I don't. That's good. A little bit far away, but okay. What did I do? Alright, you have nothing to do on you. Alright, sir, can I get one? Can you uh, get off this bench, please? And, uh, I need to know your name. My name's Fred. My name's Fred. Can I get the last name, too, please? Daphne. Fred Daphne. Alright. Daphne. You have a warrant out for your arrest, as well as you hit a motor, or a pedal bike back there with the car. I was helping the police officer. So at this time, you're helping a no, police officer. No, Mr. Daphne, we have an issue with him. you earlier striking uh, Mr. Uh, Mr. Cantu. Do you know Justin Cantu? No. Okay, well, he's uh, he's uh, a friend of, uh, of your boyfriend's, I believe. Oh, that and, little bitch. Uh, you yeah, so you, you struck him tonight with your hand. You slapped him. Oh, it was just a tap. He also... Yeah, well, either way, he that's also what hit, warrants for, okay? He also hit the bicycle just behind us. I took the rider right off the bike. He hit my car. Oh, I believe Jesus. That was Great. He scraped my car. He all damaged the front of it. It's so not fair. No one's going to say anything. Oh, I think they're getting the original cop on scene. Oh my god, how many cops do they need? I didn't even see that one. Oh wow, four cops. All of this just for a little tap. That's such BS. <laughs> Alright, sir, did you see that Crown Vic that just pulled up behind you? Uh, there. I don't know my cars, but I think so. Okay, the one in front of yours. Oh yeah. Can you walk towards that place? Oh, it's locked. I'm not. I'm not. All right. Do All right, Mr. Mopsa. Have you All seen this man it. before in your life? Yeah, that's that fucker that ran me over with the bike, with the car, with the hell, man. Oh Why'd fuck you. you. Oh my God, he's gay too. Oh my God, take me out of here, Go off the I can't be with this. That is such discrimination. Oh my deal. God. I don't right. care about right, Mr. Mopsa. Oh, wait, right. wait, hold on. You hit wait, my car. Mopsa, I want to charge him. Okay, I did hit his car, that's true. But I'm sorry about that, ma'am. You hit it multiple dollars. times, that's $5. such unfair. That made no nah, sense. Nah, not you're good, man. I'll give you $5. How, how about that? You $5? Five dollars? Trust me. I spent 100 yeah, grand on that car. Yeah, five dollars. Nah, okay, okay. We can go to the hospital. Nah, I don't like this guy. I didn't do nothing to him. He, he's gay too. Right. Bye bye, gay. That's bye. such discrimination. Right. Oh my god. <laughs> Alright. Yeah, well, because. here's the problem. He was riding his bike, and you ended up taking him off his bike with that car. Now, here's the issue. He hit Even me if first. he did hit your car, you were turning there, and you didn't check to see the bike there. That's still unsafe driving on your part. I'm sorry, say that again. I didn't understand that. What? Dad, you were turning over there. And he was on the inside, and you turned in front of his bike, forcing him to hit you, and it took you off, took him off the bike. Uh, the no, is, that's not what happened. To check before you turn. He was okay, in the junction, and I stopped a red light, and he came, and he hit my car head on. I was stopped. There's no way that's my fault. Hit dead middle of the back of your car. Sorry, what? He hit dead middle in the back of your car? No, he hit the front of my car. 
Look, there's damage up by the left headlight. Here's the problem. We have a warrant for you, which means you are going down to the station to that right now because of a 127's warrant for you. And we'll have to deal with this car. I'm going to contact that officer and see what, uh, what he said. Because I was not seen when he saw that happen, so I'm going to have to see what he said, okay? I want that guy charged for hitting my car. I was stopped at a red light and he hit me, yeah? So I backed up okay, and he uh, came and hit my car again. He kept hitting it until the cop arrived. So I'm getting a similar report. This uh, guy was hitting your car. However, the report I'm getting also had you back up and then ram him with your car. I backed up to stop him hitting me and, he and then he was fleeing from the cop so I tapped his back wheel. I didn't hit him hard. He was fleeing from the cops. Yeah, he it's was trying to make off. I just got from my own. Yeah. He didn't stop. The cop was telling him to stop, and he didn't, so I clipped his back wheel. Okay. One, that's not your job. Two, you took him off his bike and could have injured him severely, which is something even us officers are not allowed to do. I was just trying to help. So, the problem is, I know, but you're still aggravated assaulting somebody with a deadly weapon, which is what a car is classed as. That's why the, even the police won't, won't hit people like that on a pedal or even a motorcycle for that matter. So unfortunately, we are going to have to write you up for that. Can't be doing that. That's so unfair. I saw someone on the news do it before and they had a medal. Uh, you shouldn't have got one. Because you could have... All right, guys, I'm going to clear off out of here. Uh, the warrant there was for, uh, it's a battery charge. Okay, so I'm just going to add that battery charge. That's so oh, OTC. Yes. All right. Okay, sir, can you do me a favor? We're going to walk this car that's parked behind yours, my vehicle. And I'm going to have to ask you to get in the back of it, okay? Okay. That's such bullshit. I was just trying to help. All right, I'm going to have to do another one. going to... Have car problems as usual. There you go. You feel free to happen. Alright, just stay in the vehicle for a second here. I don't know why his microphone is so choppy, guys. I really don't. I wish I could help with that, but I'm afraid we're just gonna have to deal with it and make it do our best to understand. Even if you were trying to help that officer catch him, that guy was on a pedal bike, the officer was in a car, he wasn't going anywhere anytime soon. And then you hit him with a vehicle and you could keep them doing that. Like, I was it's going just like, a small threat, it's a big threat. I was going like five miles an hour. Do you know how old he is? What if he broke a hip coming off that car? That would be your fault. Then he shouldn't be fleeing from bike. the police. Well, that's his decision, but we wouldn't have hit him with the car. If he falls off on his own accord, that's one thing. It was just a tap. And he did hit me first, so I claim self-defense. Oh, well, unfortunately, your vehicle does not, does not class as yourself, so self-defense does not apply in that case. But he was attacking me. I was scared. Okay, I accept that I hit that guy, that was bad, but I was angry. But I think it's a bit unfair, I was just trying to be a good guy. And I did pull over, oh. right? Here we go. Into the cells. Is that the other guy? Oh hell yeah, man! I want a bit. Oh my god, it's okay, him. Okay, get that bit. All right, step. All right, step. All right, step right in. Is that the dude that hit me? Oh, okay. It, it may or may not. Step, step right in. Okay. The door's all right, locked. All right, all right. Face the wall. I'm gonna take the cuffs off. Yeah. Probably pretty. Nope, no. Face yeah, yeah, yeah. You got there it. You got Sorry. it. So tell me more about Miranda, man. I want to hear about her. I thought, I thought you knew kitty. all about Miranda. Okay. Come God, stick your hands to the bar. I'll cuff you. Alright, sounds like you know plenty. I'll be, I'll be right back, Mr. Mopson. Okay. Alright, sir. Um, at this time, I will be arresting you for sure for that warrant that's out. So, I'm going to read you your rights. This time, you have the right to remain silent. Anything you say will be used against you in a court of law. You have a right to an attorney, and if you cannot afford one, one will be provided for you. Do you understand these rights as I've read them? Yeah, I understand. Okay, I'm going to go fill out paperwork, okay? I got an idea. What about a verbal warning for the assault for the car? Unfortunately, assault with a deadly weapon cannot be verbally warned for. 
What if we knock it down to like GBH? I think that's no. Sorry, battery. Let yeah, battery. Well, you're already going to be getting a charge for that because that's what your warrant is for. So I can't really knock hitting someone with a car down to that. But it's he deserved really it. To do. it. Doesn't matter. You are in self-control of that vehicle. If you can't control yourself with the anger, well, then you're going to get fines for it. Can you at least whisper to the judge for oh. me, for in a good word? I'll make sure that uh, he knows you are cooperative. Alright, thanks, sweetie. Alright. Uh, well, guys, I guess we're going to jail again. Assault with a deadly weapon and battery. Yeah. Not good. Anyway, that is going to do it for today. Thank you to Jonathan, Jordan, and of course Jeff Faviano, the the Jeff Faviano. I never thought I'd ch chat up Jeff Faviano. It starts touching myself. There it is. Thanks, Jonathan. But yeah, I never thought I'd see the day where I was chatting up Jeff Faviano. But anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure you come back for the next episode, and I will see you then. Peace out, guys.